resurgence of tango all over the world. It really has been something. And the question is, why tango? In today's world of computers and smartphones, we are losing the feelings that only touching another human being can give us. In the world of salsa or swing dancing, there is no intimate embrace like there is in tango. We all need to feel part of something that is outside ourselves. And it's Forever Tango, the world tour of the internationally touring show. Forever Tango got a totally new generation of dancers interested in the grace and style of dancing that's Argentine tango. Some dancers who started modern jive or salsa find that as they progress, they want more challenging and more connected dance forms, and Argentine tango is a natural progression. There is now some jive venues that offer a second room with a mixture of blues and tango dancing. At such events, it is common to see tango-jive fusion being danced. The popularity of tango dancing has also been fed by Hollywood films that feature the dance. For instance, in 1985, the actor Robert Duvall took tango lessons from the cast members of Tango Argentino. It was about this time that the new Tango dance school started to become popular after Robert Duvall made the movie Tango Mio, My Tango. Tango spread from coast to coast thanks to the touring shows and movies. It's called Tango Americana. Tango festivals. In response to how popular tango dancing was becoming, tango dance festivals started to form all over the world. In 1989, a tango festival was held in Cincinnati, Ohio, of all places, to introduce and teach Argentine tango at a weekend-long dance festival. Wherever the touring shows, uh, they created a demand for teachers and in turn the flow and growth of tango festivals. In the Hudson Valley, we're very lucky to be having our first tango festival during the Memorial Day weekend of May 2017. You know, you could listen to Tango Radio on iTunes or on Pandora. And they're playing tango in Argentina, in Brussels, in Paraguay, uh, all over Europe, all over China, all over the world. So get to learn tango. And when you travel, you can go and drop in on a tango milonga. Here in the Hudson Valley, we're very fortunate to be having our first Tango Festival, which is going to take place during the Memorial Day weekend, uh, 2017. And we are looking for volunteers to help uh, pull this off. But you do have to take lessons. There's no substitute for learning the fundamentals well. Every dancer who wants to learn the Argentine Tango well owes it to themselves and their partners to take at least one full beginner series before going out to dance or moving on to beginning intermediate classes. If dancers rush ahead, they find they know a bunch of moves but don't doesn't feel like dancing. Learning Argentine tango is exactly like learning a language. Until you know how to use basic words like the like the, at, plant, and walk, it's useless to learn words like congress and palladium. Since you don't be able to link them except in specific patterns taught in class, and that's where the art is in that. You never know how strong you are until you dance all night in heels. Us guys, we don't have to suffer that. But it does make those beautiful those legs really look beautiful. Tango community. There's a feeling of community and inclusion in the Hudson Valley tango population. There is always room for new members to come on to the tango dance floor. Tango dances are taking place all over the Hudson Valley, the world, and the tri-state area. So what are you waiting for? Call Dojo Dance Studio today. A wonderful young couple from Argentina. In fact, as I make this video, they're back in Buenos Aires learning some more tango to teach us and share. Their studio is at 464 Main Street Beacon, New York. You also can check out Tango Under the Tent, a wonderful nonprofit tango organization in Orange County. And also, Ellen Crystal has tango classes at the Rhinebeck Dance Center 
at 7345 South Broadway, Route 9, Red Hook, New York, 845-876-3303. And they all offer reasonable rates for you to get into the world of tango. It's the doorway to tango. Of course, you can go to tangoonthehudson.com, Tango the Intimate Embrace, our YouTube site or channel, and our blog for all that's tango in the Hudson Valley. So please subscribe and share and let the word out that this wonderful dance is available to you. You don't have to stay alone in your room. You could come out and meet new people and really wonderful people. You'd be surprised the caliber of the people you meet in tango. I have been. So, please share, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next video. And I'll see you at the Milonga. Come on over and say, hey, Bill, I saw your video. Take care. Bye-bye.